I found a cheap airfare about an hour and a half ago. Went home, threw uh, stuff in a bag, and uh, we're gonna travel. So just got the rental car, got a Subaru, because of course I got a Subaru, I'm in the Pacific Northwest. Now it's time to head not into Seattle where the weather is gorgeous, but to head to Olympic National Park. And I think it's gonna be beautiful. Got to Seattle, rented a car, drove a long three hours. I mean, gorgeous scenery, as you'll agree. But it was totally worth it. <laughs> and let me show you why. Finally arrived at Crescent Lake. One of the most beautiful places I've ever seen. So this is the lodge that I'm staying at, the Lake Crescent Lodge. It is, hang on, grab my tripod. It's rustic, it's quaint, it's all those words like that. Um, it is a bit older and it's really crowded during the summers. The only reason that I was able to get a room here was somebody else left early yesterday and they put the room back into inventory and i mean that worked out well for me because i happened to be searching at like 9 a.m in dallas yesterday so caught the availability was able to book it and here we are So I have a long exposure going, which means there's a big piece of dark glass in front of the lens, just so it takes longer for the light to come into the sensor, which is gonna make those clouds up there be really streaky. Uh, so really all I do is I, I get it started and then I wait for in this case about six more minutes. I'll do an eight minute exposure and it should be beautiful. Until then, well, I just get to sit out here and look at how amazing all of this is. So my microphone shut off and that's why I'm gonna narrate this. But anyways, I'm, just, I'm telling you here that you see this bed of flowers to my right. The lake is over there behind that. And so what I'm doing is I'm using this little bed of wildflowers and the trees off to the right there to really frame this next shot of the lake and the morning sunlight uh, starting to show on the mountains over to the left side of the frame. So you always wanna use what nature is gonna give you. So I think I just walked through about 17 spider webs, so if I get bitten by a poisonous spider and die, I will miss y'all. Um, but what you can see out here that I'm paying attention to is you see how the sun is coming up over there, over the mountains. So you see the shadow of the mountains that are blocking the sun, and you see what the uh, sun is doing there. So I'm keeping an eye out for how the light is hitting, for example, up here. 
you see as I'm using my tripod to point. So that can lead to some really dramatic light. So I'm just, I'm constantly, even as I'm walking and trying to enjoy the nature, you always want to be paying attention to where the light is hitting and creating some different compositions. This is a sunrise. You just kind of see the glow coming through the trees. And then all of a sudden we walk out onto this beach. And that may be the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. When it comes to shooting like, I wouldn't call this a waterfall, but like rapids or something like this, you want to try to drag the exposure a little bit so the water's all smooth. But sometimes that means you actually need to put your tripod in the water and maybe even get your feet a little wet in order to get the right shot. But also what I'm trying to do is think about composition. So I want to try to use this like tree and that rock to frame those little rapids and I'm not going to get into the middle of the stream, although I probably should, because you have this really, this like fallen branch that goes across the path, and that would be really cool. So I just got to figure out if it's worth wading into or not. I think it's enough photography for now. I'm gonna actually relax here, and not think about photography or this vlog for a second. Just take this all in. Then I'm actually gonna take a nap because I am surprisingly tired. And uh, then it'll finally be time for breakfast. And we can see what else this park has for us. This is gonna be such a great day.